This year I will have been playing guitar for 13 years and in that time I got pretty good. <laughs> I always encourage people to learn guitar because it's cheap, it's portable, you can play modern music on it, but I always get the same excuses like, my fingers hurt, or, my fingers hurt, what's that? Or I can't change chord quick enough, or I just don't have the time. So to prove how rewarding and easy to learn guitar is, I'm going to learn the whole thing all over again by learning it the wrong way round. I'm at PMT, which is a great music store, which obviously has a huge collection of guitars and other musical instruments. And they've loaned me, for one month, a left-handed Fender Stratocaster. Let's see what we can do with this. Okay, I'm gonna start where I started when I learned guitar first time round, with this iconic tune. So frustrating. Ah, I suck. Okay, let's try a chord. Ah, oh, kudos to 16 year old me for sticking this out. So what I'm doing is learning chords. Now chords are groups of notes, two or more, that make a harmony. Now the reason I'm learning chords as opposed to single notes is because chords can get you off the ground much, much faster. If you learn just five or six different chords, you can play a whole range of popular music that you will know. And that's the key to learning guitar. Get to a point where you can start to enjoy it by playing along with songs that you actually know. So frustrated not being able to play guitar. I'm trying to remember all the pitfalls I fell into last time when I was learning guitar, the other way around. And I'm trying to avoid all those by learning the long way around, which is the right way. So some of those easy ones to avoid are holding the pick properly, using alternate up-down picking, and using the tips of your finger, not the pads, to play the notes. But guys, I really do sympathize with you. My fingers are absolutely... You suck! This hand sucks! Ah! It sounded terrible. I suck! I'm frustrated and sore and it sounds terrible and I'm just sick of it now. It's really starting to come together now. I'm starting to be able to change chords much faster than I was. Look at this. I just have a thought. It would be all too easy for me to just flip the image this way in post-production and make it seem like I'm playing guitar left-handed. So I'm gonna have to come up with some sort of proof. We've just crossed the nine hour mark and I can finally play a song all the way through. But before I show you, I want to talk about the purpose of this video, which is not to show that I can play guitar with both hands. It's not that at all. The whole point of this is to show that Joe Average, me, can learn guitar in under 10 hours and enjoy it and play along with something and make it sound musical and I really hope that that inspires you if you had been thinking about playing guitar or learning anything for that matter to just go out there pick up something cheap and go ahead and get learning and enjoy it. Now let's play some ACDC.
absolutely gonna love that. Woo! <laughs> hey Mike, it's me Destin from Smarter Every Day. I have a challenge for you. I learned how to ride the backward spring bicycle. You turn left and it goes right, vice versa. It took me eight months to do this. This is a bamboo saxophone. The milestone for this one is to learn how to play the first minute of the jazz piece, Take Five by Dave Brubeck. <laughs> Yes, that's a tick. That's a tick. Yeah. <laughs>